It's Victoria's first ever creative reuse center and it's helping artists, teachers and students find affordable supplies. Supply Victoria also helps to divert items from the landfill, but the nonprofit is moving and needs your help. Oh yeah, this has got some textile supplies in here. Carly Stefanowicz loves sorting through the treasure trove of sustainable materials at Supply Victoria Creative Reuse Center. I'm a textiles artist working only with upcycled cloth and natural dyes. Uh, so Supply Victoria is one of those perfect places to be able to get a lot of my supplies. And the unique range of art supplies is endless. We have like tons of paint and paint brushes. So like classic traditional art supplies, but then we have other things that you might not deem traditional art supplies, like wine corks or um, the mesh bags you get your fruit and veggies in. As a creative reuse center, Supply Victoria's mission is to divert materials from the landfill and put them in the hands of artists, students and teachers. So those are really popular in the States. There's over 130 of them in America but they're a relatively new thing to Canada. So essentially they operate like thrift stores for art supplies. So we offer low cost art office and school supplies that are more affordable and more sustainable alternatives. I think it's just awesome how they just remove so much from ending up in the landfill and giving everything a second chance to be used. Holly Maloney started volunteering here a few months ago. As a student in environmental studies, I'm really passionate about learning about sustainable businesses and something I want to be part of in the future, and this is just a perfect one that I love to support. But the supplies at Supply Victoria are now all packed up as the nonprofit shuts down this month to move from this arts hub to a new location by Crystal Garden. I'm sad because this space has been a really great home for us, um, and it helped us grow and it's been really amazing being nestled in here with 80 artists and four art galleries in the tool lending library but now it's become necessary for us to move. The move will give supply more space, a more accessible entrance and a better loading zone for people to drop off donations but rent will be higher and moving is expensive. So supply launched a GoFundMe to help. As a nonprofit, we're operating on a very limited budget. We're looking for the community support to be able to make this move a reality and to give everybody the creative reuse center that they deserve. From corks to crayons, Victoria's first nonprofit creative reuse center has already redistributed thousands of kilograms of materials as it crafts a more sustainable future. And do you find you get inspiration from always? Yeah, every time I come here, it's like a little hide and seek. Like I know for sure what I'm looking for, but I always end up leaving with like a new craft or like some office supplies. Supply Victoria hopes to reopen at the new location in mid-February. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.